Well, you boys look like you're having fun. If you're gonna speak your mind, you should really pay attention to where you are. You never know, some rogue knight might slip out of the guardroom and come passing by. Okay? His Royal Highness. Hey. Huh. Where's His Majesty, Ferret? He went out through the back. He's a busy man, you know. Never mind that. Kyle, where have you been? Me? <laughs> Nowhere. Just wanted to see the prince, that's all. That's all? Do you always take your duty so lightly? Your Royal Highness. Sir, you must be exhausted after your inspection of Lord Lake. Actually, I should have accompanied you on your trip, but His Majesty didn't give me the order. Of course he did. After all, Lord Lake is your hometown, isn't it, Galleon? Farad wouldn't make you go there. The guy's not heartless, you know. Yes. But I have already been back there once. His Majesty needn't protect me. But Kalion, I don't see how you could ever come to terms with it. It's been two years, but the Queen still won't even let them rebuild. Man, talk about heartless. Hold your tongue, Kyle. Elenia? 
Her Majesty imposed a suitable punishment on those traitors, plain and simple. She did what a queen has to do. And we, the Queen's Knights, have no business second-guessing her. Yeah, that's what you say, Elenia, but- Silence, Kyle. No matter the circumstances, the fact remains that the people of Lord Lake committed treason. They must serve their penance. I'm sorry, guys, but I think the Queen went way too far. Kyle, how dare you disrespect our Queen! The Sun Rune is proof enough that this nation and Her Majesty have Heaven's divine blessing. It's only natural the Rune's judgment would come down on anyone who dares defy Her Majesty's authority. If you ask me, I don't think Her Majesty has used the Sun Rune enough. Yeah, right. You're starting to sound just like Lord Godwin. And on that note, I don't know if I can trust a knight who's merely a pawn of the Godwin family. Insolent fool! You're one to talk seeing how you're just a mouthpiece for the Boros family! Ridiculous. You don't know what the hell you're talking about. That will be enough. Do you realize how disgracefully you're acting in front of His Royal Highness? We are terribly sorry, Your Highness. We should be protecting the royal family, not getting involved in private quarrels that might affect our duties. Kyle, especially you. Huh? Me? Your manner of speaking sounds like criticism of Her Majesty. You should restrain yourself a little. That's all right, Zaha. Please, everybody, continue. Your commandership. Find me, as you were. As you all know, Her Majesty has been troubled ever since the split between the two factions of the Senate. The Godwin faction has been gaining more and more power recently, which has caused Her Majesty much anguish. At a time like this, Her Majesty wants true loyalty from us, the Queen's Knights. Some people may believe that Knights must give absolute obedience to their master. But that's not true loyalty. True loyalty means being able to speak openly about what you think is right and what you think is wrong. Of course, I'd be upset with any fool who thought he could criticize Her Majesty wherever and whenever he wanted. But at the very least, in this room, I want us to be able to express our views openly without fear of reprisal. Now, if there are any constructive opinions you'd like to share with Her Majesty, I'd be happy to pass them on for you. Understood? Yes, yes sir. sir! Leon. Your Majesty? When you two have thoughts and ideas of your own, please don't be shy about sharing them with us. The Queen's Knights are known for their artistry with a blade, but they also have much wisdom and insight to impart. Be wise and heed their words. Yes, sire. Get mad. 
you when you talk to me like that? Uh, Princess, you sound pretty mad to me. Princess! Did you find your brother? get that angry, you look just like a pug-nosed tomboy, you know? <laughs> oh boy, there she goes with that nonsense again. <laughs> <laughs> 